Hey friends. Welcome to week three of living worship. Um, my cat has decided to join me for today's session, so apologies. Um, if this is your first week joining me for living worship, I am so glad that you're here. Um, if you have been following along for the ride the past two weeks, I am so glad that you're back. What this time will look like is basically for the next 15 to 20 minutes, I will walk us through some motions, some movements to do with our bodies while we talk about and worship God. Um, if you have an exercise mat like mine, you're welcome to roll it out. You can also roll out a towel, or if you could take your device outside, you're welcome to do this out in the grass, in the sun, whatever feels the best to you. As we go through these motions and movements, if there's anything that doesn't feel good to you, um, if something hurts or if it's uncomfortable, you don't have to do it. You can always find a seated position until there's something you want to do, um, or you can stretch and move in any way that feels good to you during this time together. Um, if something is confusing or you just want some extra time to, to work on a movement or to try it, you can always pause, you can rewind, you really can't do this wrong. Um, so I, I welcome you and I invite you to engage with this however feels good to you. Today, we are going to be talking about kindness. So we're going to talk about the ways that our trust in God allows us to trust ourselves and how that helps us to be kind to ourselves and to other people. Um, my cat just left the room, so I'm going to shut this door really quickly and then we will get started. Okay, so as we start today, you can find a comfy seated position. You can sit with your legs crossed like me. You can also stretch them out or put them up in front of you, whatever's comfortable. But I'm gonna sit like this. And we are going to breathe in and out together. And I'm gonna say some words while we do it. I'm gonna say, I listen to myself as we breathe in. And then as we breathe out, gonna say with kindness. You can say those words with me or you can just listen, whatever's better for you. But we are gonna do this three times. I'm gonna breathe in. I listen to myself with kindness. I listen to myself with kindness. Last one. I listen to myself kindness. Awesome. So for our next move, we are going to stand up, but if I stand up, you can't see me on the screen anymore. So I'm going to stay on my knees, but you can stand all the way up if that works for you. So you can stand up or join me on your knees. We are going to stand like a tall tree and remember that when we are firmly rooted in God's loving kindness, we are strong, we are unshakable. So we are going to breathe in and out three times in this position. So in and out. In and out. Last one, in and out. Awesome. Now if you are already standing, you're in a perfect position, but if like me you're on your knees, you're going to want to stand up and then reach up to the sky and fold forward as far as you can. I'm not very flexible. I can't touch my toes, so if you can't either, that's a-okay. While you're folded forward, you want to keep your knees a little bent. Don't lock them because that's not very good for you. So you're going to keep your hands as far down as you can and point your eyes straight forward at the ground. Awesome. And while we are stretching, remember that we have our eyes open and set forward. We are preparing for what is to come, knowing that God has us and we have nothing to fear. So we're going to breathe in and out three times, in and out. 
in, out, in, and out. Awesome. So now we are going to sit back, kind of like a chair, okay? You're gonna keep your feet shoulder width apart. You're gonna sit back and down. Awesome, make sure your knees don't go over your toes like that. Not good for you. So just like you're a chair, this is a good position to practice trusting ourselves. Trust that you are strong and you are capable. When we trust ourselves, we can work on being kind to ourselves. We're gonna breathe in and out three times, in and out, in, out, last one, in, and out. Okay, we can stand up. We are gonna go back into mountain, into standing like a tall tree. Remember, I can't stand all the way up because then you can't see my face, but you can stand all the way up and I'm gonna stay on my knees. So now that we have practiced trusting ourselves in a position that might feel kind of hard, we are going to reground ourselves like tall trees and remember that through God's love and trust, we can trust ourselves and be kind to ourselves because we are strong and unshakable. So we are going to breathe in and out three times back in this position. So in, out, in, and out. In and out. That is fantastic. So next, if you've been with me before, then we have done this together. So you are going to, if you're standing up, you can go ahead and come down to your knees. That'll make this a little easier. We're going to take our hands and place them in front of you. Then lay on your stomach. Perfect. And while your hands are right here in front of you, you're going to push up. Look up and out. Now I am facing a window so I can see trees and the sun outside. Maybe you are facing a wall or facing your computer. Either way, we are going to look up and out. And trust that because God loves us and we love ourselves. We can trust ourselves no matter what the day will bring. We have no reason to fear. So we are going to breathe in and out here three times. So three, two, and one. Awesome. This might be another familiar one. You're going to take your feet, put your toes down on the ground, and we're going to push up and out. Great. In this triangle, we get a big stretch, maybe at the backs of your knees. And we remember that sometimes we have to stretch ourselves to fulfill God's call. But it's okay because we love ourselves and we can trust ourselves. So we are going to breathe in and out here three times. So in and out. In out. Last one. In and out. Fantastic. So now you're just going to bring your knees down to the ground. Remember our first week together, we sat like tables with flat backs. And this time we are going to round our backs up, kind of like a cat. And then you're going to push all the way down with your belly the opposite direction. So when we do this motion, we can remember that sometimes we might need to draw inward. Um, and sometimes we might need to stretch ourselves and really push outward. But that whatever we feel is welcome and okay. We can honor any feelings we have because we are kind to ourselves and we love ourselves just like God does. So we can do this three times together. So you can go up and breathe in. 
down and out. Two more times, so up and in. Down and out. Last one, up and in. Down and out. Awesome. So our next move, we are going to scoot forward, sit back on your bottom. For this one, you're gonna put your hands right behind your knees, lift your feet up off the ground. And here we are practicing balance. So when we practice balance, which can be tough, maybe you're rocking, maybe you fall and put your feet back on the ground, but we know that that's okay because we're kind to ourselves and we love ourselves. And we can trust ourselves because God trusts us and loves us too. So it's okay to try balancing even if we're not perfect. So we can hold this for three seconds. So three, two, and one. Fantastic. So we are gonna come back to our original seated position. Remember, if this isn't how it's comfy for you to sit, that's totally fine. You can sit however you like. And while we are sitting today, we are gonna say some words together. We're gonna to use different words this time. So when we breathe in, we're gonna say, I celebrate being God's child. We're gonna breathe out and love myself. So we're gonna say that three times. You can either say it with me or just listen. We're gonna breathe in. I celebrate being God's child and love myself. I celebrate being God's child and love myself. I celebrate being God's child and love myself. Awesome, that is all of our movements. Y'all did an amazing job. We are gonna go through that whole set one more time. We're gonna do a little bit more quickly. We're not gonna take as much time to explain, but you can always pause if you need a few extra seconds. You can rewind or fast forward. Use this however you want to, however feels good to you. Okay, so we are gonna stay seated and get started just like last time. We're gonna say, I listen to myself with kindness as we breathe in and out three times. Say in. I listen to myself with kindness. I listen to myself with kindness. I listen to myself with kindness. Okay, now remember, we're gonna stand up like tall trees, but I'm gonna stay on my knees so you can see me. We are strong and rooted in God's love and trust in us. We are unshakable. So we'll breathe in and out three times, in and out. In and out. In and out. Okay. Next, we are going to fold forward. So if you're standing up, you're just going to lean all the way down. Those knees a little bent. Remember, we are facing forward, eyes open as we prepare for what is to come. Breathe in and out three times. So in and out. In and out. In and out. Awesome. So next, remember, we are going to sit back like we're sitting in a chair. Keep those knees lined up with your toes, not over. Perfect. Remember, when we're in this position, we're working on trusting ourselves. 
We are stretching and trusting that we are strong and capable and we can be kind to ourselves if this is hard and we take a break. So we're gonna breathe in and out three times. So in and out, in and out, in and out. Awesome, you did it. So next, you can stand up. I'm gonna go on my knees. We are back standing like a tall tree. After we practice something that might be hard, might feel new, it is helpful to remind ourselves that we are rooted in God's trust and love, that we can trust and love ourselves. We are gonna breathe in and out three times. So three, two, and one. Awesome. Now we're gonna go down in our bellies, just like before. Take your hands to your sides, place them on the ground. Lay all the way down on your belly and push up. Remember that we are looking up and out at the day to come. And because we trust ourselves and are kind to ourselves, we know that we have nothing to fear. Breathe in and out three times, so three, Two and one. Awesome. Remember, next we're going to take those feet, put our toes down, and then push up and back like a big triangle. This is a big stretch, so we'll remember it's okay to stretch ourselves for God because we can trust ourselves and be kind to ourselves. And breathe in and out three times. So three, two, and one. Okay, you can bring your knees down. Come like a nice strong table and we are going to breathe in and push up, then breathe out and push down. Because sometimes we need to draw up and in, and sometimes we need to push ourselves and stretch out. All of those feelings are okay and honored because God is kind and loving to us and we are kind and loving to ourselves. Okay, so we are gonna do this three times, so in and up, down, out, two more, last one, awesome, now we're going to bring our knees up and sit back and you can swing your feet in front of you. Put those hands behind your knees and balance, even if it's hard, even if you fall. Because we can practice balance, because we're kind to ourselves and we trust ourselves. It's okay if we rock, if we fall, because God loves us and we love ourselves no matter what. So we can breathe in and out here three times. So three, two, And one. Fantastic, you did it. And we are going to find our seated position once more. And remember, we are going to breathe in and say, I celebrate being God's child. And we're gonna breathe out and say, I love myself. So join me in that three times. I'm gonna breathe in. I celebrate being God's child out and love myself. I celebrate being God's child and love myself. 
I celebrate being God's child and love myself. Fantastic. We did it. Um, and I am so glad that you joined me for today's Living Worship, and I cannot wait to see you again next week. Goodbye. Have a wonderful week. Thank you so much for joining me.